Hello everyone, welcome. My name is Tisa and it's so great to have everyone here. I am here right now looking into July the 2nd through July the 4th is 2023. So I'm here right now and I'm looking into the fighter signs right here is Aries, Leo, and Sagittarius. This is the next 48 hours or so, July the 2nd through the 4th, 2023. Everything of course you need to know about me, it is down below in the description box, okay? So let's see what we have coming up here. This is fire signs, Aries, Leo, and Sagittarius, okay? We have forgiving and learning right there, okay? Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, what do they need to accept, please? July the 2nd through July the 4th of 2023 for Aries, Leo, and Sagittarius. July the 2nd through July the 4th of 2023, please, for Aries, Leo, and Sagittarius. Okay, what does Aries, Leo, Sagittarius need to acknowledge, please? July the 2nd through July the 4th of 2023, what do they need to acknowledge? Okay. What do they need to know? Okay, what does uh, um, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius need to know? Okay, let yourself receive is right here. And then we have right here, connect is what you need to acknowledge. What you need to accept, ask what you want in the romance card we have right here. Okay, so let's see here. Okay. So I'm here like Kundalini, something like that. <laughs> so here like Kundalini, okay? So I was like, you had awakening or maybe you are or something like that. But anyway, let yourself receive right here. It says, allow others to give you living care, receive it without guilt, and receive it without apologies, right here. Okay. Something like, you have a hamster or something? Like somebody has a hamster or something like that. Or well, maybe you have a pet. Something like that right here. Yeah, two of cups right here. A true love of soulmate right here. It says let yourself receive. A true love of soulmate could be the case right here. True love of soulmate right here. Okay. Holy Spirit, holy angels, let yourself receive. What's the message right here now? Okay, so this one right here says three of cups right here in reverse, right? So let yourself receive a lover right here, okay? Um, now this one here is about falling in love, okay? Now this one right here could be like friends, all right? So um, hmm, maybe somebody's like, okay, all right, let's see. Let's see what, what's the message right here, okay? King of Wands is reverse right here, okay, yeah. Ten of Swords right here. So this is about love, I feel, right here. All right. Um, the real covers. Okay, King of Wands reverse. This is somebody here that's lacking the motivation, or they could be a player. They could be a player right here. Okay. Somebody could be lacking the motivation to reconcile with somebody right here with this one. Or it's the case right here, like somebody's a player, they didn't want to let go of a third party for some people right here. It could be the case. Okay. And they didn't let go of the third party for some people, they could have lost the true love of the soulmate. Maybe that's what happened here. All right. They didn't let go of the third party because it was a player or they was lacking a motivation or something like that right here. Yeah. Yeah. I feel like somebody here was having an illusion in some way. Okay. That's what I'm getting here. There was a player right here for this one. Right, or they was lacking the motivation. Some people right here, in some way, to do something right here to have investment. They even could have walked away from the investment right here for some people right here. Okay, that could have been a secret right here, or this is a cancer or Pisces right here, like that, right? So somebody could have walked away from somebody right here because they went to a cancer or Pisces could be the case. Judgment reverse. What's it? What's the judgment right here? Reverse. Okay. Tower. Defeated right here. Okay. So if somebody had a third party in some type of way, all right, I feel like somebody's letting go of the third party here. Because the three of cups reverse is letting go of the third party for some people here. So for some people here, all right, I'm getting like somebody's ending their player ways right here. 
because I feel like they used to have third parties or something like that. I feel for some people, they could be ending it. They play away for some people with, with the Ten of Swords. Maybe they're ending it. Okay. And it could be because you figured out something. Maybe you figured out a, a third party. So I feel like somebody's going to end it right here. Yeah, because I feel like that could be a secret or you know somebody's secrets or something like that. Yeah, so I feel, I'm getting right here with the world and the tower right here. There's some cycle complete right here, I feel like. And it could be like abruptly or something is disrupted here quickly. Somebody knows they defeated somebody. All right, so somebody's defeated somebody right now. This energy check here, somebody's defeated right here. They're defeated by a third party. So they could be lacking the motivation to deal with you. You could be like, where they at? Okay, I feel like they're defeated by having a third party situation right now. Okay, so yeah, I'm gonna like, something like that could abruptly end. Some third party situation could abruptly end because they wanna let themselves receive a love for some people here. All right, um... Here's another thing. If somebody was lacking the motivation to be with you before in the past or something, they could be realizing that something ended for some people right here. But that's the energy check we got going on right here. All right. Either somebody's going to let their self, you know, let you in. All right. Because they want to, they want to love you and be a, be a relationship right here with you. They're going to do that for some people here because they want to be with you. They might even end their play away. So I'm getting like it's abruptly right here. The world and the tower, it ends for some people right here. That's one way it could be. I end my play ways. Tower world. That's over. Three. Okay. Um, so that's for some people. All right. And like I said, for others, something could have gone on in the past. Somebody was lacking the motivation or something like that to do something right here. And they was defeated and they realizing that right now. Okay. So let me see what we got going on here. This connect card. Now look at this. What a card. This woman stands right here. First of all, on water. Is she? It looks like it. Yeah. Standing on water, okay? And then look, she's straight connected to the clouds in the universe. So somebody here had awakening, I feel. They could be a psychic, could be the case. They're very much connected to heaven and earth or something like that. As above, so below, absolutely, I feel. I even feel like something that somebody said right here, is, it is what it is, something like that. <laughs> it says, find your center. When we stay connected to our spiritual core, the best and most advantageous paths that unfold before us. That was your acceptance, I feel, right here, right? That when you stay connected to the universe, right? Paths open up for you or something like that, I feel. Okay. I'm getting like walking on water. Wow. <laughs> Serious right there. You had a seven of cups right here, all right? Yes. Okay. Something's wishful thinking. Somebody know that you're connected to the universe. God and your angels, they know that. Okay, so somebody's play of ways could definitely end. I'm getting like abruptly right here for some people right here. Okay. This even could be for somebody here. They abruptly say, I'm not reconciled with somebody. That could be the case here in some way. Okay, but somebody does feel like you're good news. If somebody knows that you're good news right here, some play of ways or something like that, that is wishful thinking. For some people, they're smart enough to know that for some people right here. I feel they know that. I feel. They know you believe in yourself. I'm gonna like this Sagittarius wanna hold on to you or you wanna hold on to the Sagittarius right here. Could be the case here. Okay. Somebody wants to hold on to you. Yeah. Somebody somebody knows that you believe in yourself right here and that you will give up about something right here. Just pray it. Okay. I'm getting from my will to thy will right here. This one right here. See that that right there? Speaking out. So I feel like that from my will to thy will, somebody's very much in tune with the universe right here. As above, so below. <laughs> it's pretty, something like that. What you speak out is very much power behind it. I'm getting right here for somebody right here. Yeah, okay. Yeah, this even could be a magic spell for some people right here. Could be the case right here. Some magic spells, wishful thinking. Somebody's connected right here to heaven and earth, something like that. <laughs> could be the case. This even could be you're consciously aware about something right here. If they tempted with other lovers or something like that, you're consciously aware of something like that. So that's definitely not correct. Like this Sagittarius is all the way aware right here. Okay. Could be a Gemini, a Virgo, or a Capricorn. They are aware of get right here. Okay. Okay, this period. Okay. Yeah. Some of you, somebody knows that you're a keeper. They want to hold on to you. I'm getting like, they're player ways, tower in the world. It's over. For some people here, that's over for some people here. All right. 
That's not good for some. They, they really do understand who you are over here. For some people right here. Okay. Others right here. Right. Somebody did not understand who you was in the past. And they're about to see right here exactly who you are. I feel for some people here. They're about to see something like that. I look like a curse or something. It could be the case. I don't know. But it could be with the devil. And uh, anyway, I'm not going to get deep to it. So the justice card is reversed right here. So that's bad karma in some way. Could be a Libra. But something here is bad karma for doing a black magic spell or something like that. That's bad karma or something like that. Okay. Because I'm getting like they could even did it more than once with the um the devil and the magician. Maybe they was doing black magic spell more than once right here. Okay. They could have even send it, sent you into awakening right here for some people right here because of something that was going on here. Or you just connected. Okay. And they're definitely gonna get bad karma I'm getting right here for some magic spell for some people here. All right. Here's another thing right here. If they really want to be with you, they know right here they're going to get bad karma because you're all the way connected with heaven and earth. Or like you had awakening or your intuition. This card right here is like, it's not a joke here. Okay. You're too much connected. And somebody definitely does know that I feel right here. Okay. So, um, yeah, if they're not working t together with you, for some people right here, they don't want to move on from you or they don't want you to move on. So, for some of you, you know, they know they will get bad karma right here if they didn't want to move on from the third party or for some people here. And like I said, others right here, they have bad karma right now because they did not see who you was before. They definitely did not see that, I feel, right here before. And I'm getting like, now they, being, they, they are seeing right here that you're actually psychic right here or that you are intuitive or that you're very much aware about something right here in some way, I feel. It's like when you ask for something, it comes through. Let the universe know what you need, okay? So when you ask the universe for something right here, it's going to happen or it comes through or something like that, I feel right here. Yeah. They didn't see that about you. They definitely did not see that about you before for some people right here, all right? Um, this even could be somebody here, they're asking to have sex with somebody right here. And somebody is definitely saying no to them, I feel. Okay, that could be the case for some people right here. <laughs> Yeah, okay. So somebody has come out to come like they, they very much understand who you are, I feel, right here. You know, they understand who you are. They know that they could lose you for some people right here, okay? And this is somebody from the past that didn't know something. They realize that now they can't have sex with you. They could have thought right here that, um, you know, if they wasn't into you sexually or whatever, maybe somebody's going to know something like that, okay? And I'm mean, like, that's unexpected to them or they kind of feel embarrassed or something that you know about sex in some way. I feel like for some people here, it could be an Aries right here, right? Definitely both of these is Aries and I have Gemini's down here. Okay, but that's unexpected to them right here that you made a decision not to, you know, not to talk to them or something like that, right? Or have sex with them for some people right here. And then like I said, for others, they, they done told this third party that they're not having sex with them. That's pretty, or they, they blocked them or something like that, I feel. You know, because I feel like they want to get things right with you right here. It says forgiving and learning as you release and heal the past, you experience more love in your present moments right here. Okay, so this person wants to make things right with you right here. Okay, and I'm getting like, it's not wish fulfillment right here. And now they have to, you know, you know, want your forgiveness or something like that. It's not wish fulfillment to somebody. They don't want to go through that, I feel. Something like that because they just know that who you're worth. And whatever happened right here in the past, they're learning from that, I feel. You know? For some people, it's like a struggle right here, right, um, to get past whatever happened before in the past. So for some people, it's a missed opportunity. They can't get back together with you. And others right here, they don't want to lose you right here, okay? It's real hard to get past something here that happened in the past in some way. So they do want to work this out right here with you. Yeah. Okay. Somebody knows that you would end something right here. I feel like for some of you, if they was missing an opportunity with you before, that, that may definitely end. I feel like for some of you, the ending right here is like, I want this opportunity with you now. Like, I really do want to work these things out right here with you. So some people here, okay. Yeah, Ace of Wands reverse. Okay. Okay. They know that they will lose you. I feel like some third party is over. It's over for you. Okay. They could be having hope before that they could be single. That's not going to work with you. And they know that. They know that for somebody here. Either way, if it's a third party or if it was if it was a third party before, they know right now they really want to work this out right here with you now. All right. 
if this was somebody right here from the past and you decided right here that you just simply cannot work this out with them, they realize right here that you all the way in tune. Okay, you might know about magic spell. They have bad karma for doing a magic spell if they was doing it. For some people, it's bad karma. They know that. Okay, so something like that is wishful thinking they could do a magic spell. Because you still know about something right here in some way. But, yeah, that's the energy I got going on right now for you. Let me see if there's anything else right here. Yeah, so for some of you, they regret. They regret because whatever choice they made when they was at a fork in the road for some people, right? All right? And then others right here, it's like five of cups and a two of wands. I'm at a fork in the road right here. And I really do want to be with you. They may, they, they really may choose right here that they want this for some people here, okay? But that's what's going on right now, okay? Yeah, so that's what I have, okay? Thank you so much for tuning in. I send you all peace, blessings, love, and light. Namaste to you.